January 17th, and it's time for the news. I'm Sanders. And I'm Bryce. We have the news about clubs, the school dance, weather, and more coming up. But first, please stand up for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I, I pledge allegiance to, to the flag of the United, United States, States of America, America and, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, nation under God, God indivisible, indivisible, with liberty, liberty and, justice and justice for all. Here's the news. Don't miss out on the Black Light Sadie's Dance on Friday, January 26th. This is the final school-wide dance of the year and will happen directly after the basketball game, the neon-themed dog pack. The gym doors will open at 9 p.m. and the dance will end at 11 p.m. Ticket sales and guest bids are now available. Pick up slots just in the back of the admin building. It's free for those with ASB, although you do need to come to student accounts to load the free ticket onto your account. For all other FHS students, it's $15, and non-FHS guests pay $20. Please turn the completed guest bids into the AP office on Wednesday, January 21st for, for approval. There are no refunds. Also, Interact registration is still open. Interact is a worldwide high school branch of Rotary that offers a variety of community service hours. Interact also tracks those hours for you, making it easy for you to show off your hours to colleges. Interact is currently looking for volunteers to be a part of the ASE program. Arts for Special Education is a weekly volunteer opportunity where you create arts and crafts with young adults and children who have special needs, making meaningful connections with them on the way. ASE was started during the pandemic by a former FHA student to give kids with special needs an opportunity to still stay social and connect with their peers. For more information, visit interactfolsom.weebly.com or contact butterysport at gmail.com. Attention student speakers, Rotary Club has announced their topic for this year's speech competition, Create Hope in the World. First place winner on March 7th can go and on to earn $1,500. Three finalists representing FHS will be determined on February 28th. See Ms. Posner in HS 104 for contest information. Would you like to earn volunteer hours, earn a cord at graduation, impress colleges, and have fun at the same time? Join the California Schol Scholarship Federation, also known as CSF which is one of the biggest clubs at Folsom High School. Registration is open to all grades, including freshmen. Registration is from January 22nd to February 2nd, after school at Miss Dollar's room, HS 108. The last day to pay the $10 fee is Wednesday, January 31st, and you will not be able to make payments after. First meeting will be on Monday, February 5th. There will be a workshop on how to fill out the forms on January 24th and January 31st in Miss Dollar's room. Follow their Instagram at Folsom High CSF for more information and updates. Attention world language students. The time has come to register for World Language Scholar Society for the spring 2024 semester. There are op their opening level registration to level two language students. So make sure to sign up if you're interested. To join their new Google Classroom, use the code 750GXOZ. Visit their Instagram page at World Language Scholar Society or see the flyers around campus for more information. Wait a minute. What about the weather? Let's head over to Grace in the Weather Center. Another edition attached and brought here, Bulldog Broadcast, bringing creative critical conditions of the calendar week, diving into deep daily dew and drops, extending into the error-free extra epic. Finally, the fulsome forecast. Nearly freezing low, but going to graduate into growing clouds with a glorious glimpse of the sun, a happily similar Thursday with a hanging hiding sun. Inching into Friday, an incessant increase in rain, jumping to a jovial weekend of jackets and mitts. Sunday is a kick of rain, and to kick off Monday, we have no lack of cold, leading to a likelihood of a love of menus and meals that melt that numbing no-good nastiness. Overcoats and other objects providing perfect comfort preferred. Questing off to our quintessential wind report, relaying our rushing and not at all rushing wind of 20 miles per hour, some significant visibility of 9 miles. Searching the Sierras and Tahoe, a totally telling forecast shows a troubling total of clouds. Umbrellas are an unyieldingly unique, uncoy voyage for protection under varying varieties of snow and rain, a wackily wet weekend. Our weather segment has hopefully been quite zenial, and you might yield to yearn to understand the gimmick here, yet a conclusion to our alphabetic weather has yet to be found. Zamboni. Congratulations to the Folsom High wrestling team who clapped the thunder from Rockland with a 72-0 score on Wednesday night at FHS. Thank you to the students who came to support in their blackout attire, Great job by our varsity seniors getting wins on the night, including 
Dominique Lopez, Chase R.J. Mansky, Luke Supple, Xander Webster, Alec Coffin, and Angelo Sardo. Yes, congrats, congrats once again to the Folsom High Wrestling team who finished fourth out of 85 teams from all over California and Nevada and at the Tim Brown Memorial Tournament over the weekend. Folsom had five medalists at the prestigious events including Ryland Smith, Chase Mansky, Xander Webster, Preston Makinich, and Nicholas Sportswood. Smith made the finals and pinned the number eight ranked wrestler in all of California. This Wednesday, undefeated Folsom will take on undefeated Del Oro in a match that will likely decide the Sierra Foothill League Championship. Good luck, Bulldogs. This is Thursday, January 18th. There will be a speaker in Mr. Baez's classroom. John Scalise from the Navy will be there at pause. So come check it out. That's all the news for today, Folsom High. Shout Thank you for to Peepaw. Shout Thank you for tuning in. Make it, let's make it a great day to be a Bulldog. <laughs>